What is up guys, Zack Scott here, playing Mario Plus Rapid Sparks of Hope for the Nintendo Switch. I am bringing you a deluxe episode to start things off, and I was able to do so because Ubisoft sent me a free code for this game, which I already had on pre-order. Thanks to you guys, my channel features some of the most popular Mario videos on YouTube. In fact, my first episode of the original Mario Plus Rapids Kingdom Battle got over 15 million views, all thanks to you leaving over 86,000 likes. I will be thrilled if this video got anywhere close, so please drop a like on this video. Also, thanks to your support, we now have over 5.1 million subscribers. That's incredible, and I cannot thank you enough. I'll do my best to bring you even more awesome videos. Just leave a comment below letting me know which games made you subscribe and which games you want to see me play in the future. Now, without further ado, let's play Mario Plus Rapid Sparks of Hope. Here we go. Yay. Princess Peach says, Mario, Rabbit Peach, Beepo, I'm so relieved to see you. The rabbits are especially exuberant today. Someone has misplaced Rabbit Mario's overalls. <laughs> I like how they're all working on like these beautiful topiaries of the characters and stuff. Now it just looks like a dinosaur. Oh, what's that? They're missing, and he's too embarrassed to come out from that bush he's hiding in. <laughs> he's naked. Where's his overalls? Ooh, ooh! If I catch the thief who took my overalls, where are they? <laughs> Let's see. Can you please look and find Rabbit Mario's overalls? Try checking the trees or the bushes. Consider it done, my beloved princess. We are happy to serve. All right, that one has voice acting. <laughs> All right, so an overall. Nice day. Find Rabbit Mario's overalls. Okay, so this shouldn't be too bad. Let's go talk to the princess. Rab Rabbit Mario needs your help. I know that. I know that. Someone hid Rabbit Mario's overalls. Have you checked the bushes? Okay, yeah, I know. I know, I know. My beautiful overalls. I can't come out without my overalls. Check the bushes. Shake the trees. Just find them. All right, so we know what to do. I'll take some coins. Uh, there is a bush over here. I don't know if there's a real way to, to check it. Lots of butterflies are checking that out. What's up with you, though? People always say to me, move R to look around. No idea why. I know why. So, any he... Shake it. Shake, shake the bush. How many times do I got to shake it? It's not there. It's not there. Ever heard the phrase, hold X to boost? Makes no sense to me. But what do I know? Yeah, that's how you boost. And then Luigi. Th those aren't Rabbit Mario's for sure, but I smell something fishy. These overalls are mine. Check the size on the tag if you don't believe me. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, let's check the tree. Let's see what... Coins fell out of the tree. Okay, that's cool. And then down here, oh, here's, are these bushes get, no, not these, not these, not these. Oh, that one's glowing. I'm just going to go straight to it since it's glowing. I don't want to waste time. There we go. There are some overalls right there. And then bring Rabbit Mario his overalls. Sure enough, we will. This seems to be just like a tutorial. Hey, let, let's boost a little bit. Let's take a shortcut down over here. There you go. You're welcome. Now he's dressed. I'm a back. <laughs> I'm a back. <laughs> Was that the Chris Pratt voice? No. Ta-da! Back in business. <laughs> all right. Now let's all gather up. Oh, you found your overalls, Robin Mario. I knew I should have hid them somewhere else. Oh, he hid them. Okay, I got it. Where's his red shirt, though? Ah, yes. You want to be just like Robin Mario, but only one of us can look this good in casual alternatives to pants. <laughs> All right, all's well that ends well. Now we can enjoy this beautiful day in peace and harmony. Absolutely, yeah. oh absolutely, God, nothing's gonna go wrong. Complete. We can now kick back and relax, safe in the knowledge that everything is under control. Okay, Beepo, don't jinx it for us. Ha <laughs> ha! Uh-oh, what's in the sky? Oh. <laughs> oh dear. Oh wow. Ew. It's got its ink everywhere. Oh no. <laughs> She's a real influencer. Oof. And she's dead. No. 
Nice, it's got a handle. Ew. I think Mario's in a different dimension. <laughs> All right, so the adventure begins now. This is exciting. From cover to cover. All right, we're right in the action. This is exciting. Reach area. So I don't even have to beat these guys. I just have to reach the area. Is that, is that true? Don't panic, Rabbit Peach. We'll just stroll casually along the back of this flying creature and reach your location in no time. Okay, sounds good. I'm not panicked. Uh -oh. Strike the words casual, stroll, and don't panic. We got hostiles incoming. They look, they look like skeletons almost. Mario, take cover and don't get caught out in the open. Move from cover to cover and remember to attack. Okay, I'll attack. Here we go. I'm ready. I think I understand what this is about. Get behind cover to protect your hero from enemies. While taking cover, you can aim with ZL at enemies and hit them while remaining protected. Okay, got it. Okey All right, so we move. This looks good. So wait, is this a little more live action than, than before? Oh, nice. Uh, dual slinger, 55 to 65 damage. Fires two projectiles, uh, either at one target or two separate ones. Confirm the first target and select a second. There you go. That was a critical. Is he okay? Oh, they're, they're actually okay. I should've just fired the sa at the same one twice. All right, that missed. Oh, it's exposed. So the, the movement's really interesting. I, you know, it seemed like, well, what can I do? Can I actually aim at anything right now? No, I can't. So let me just go back. Maybe I can move here, and then I can maybe aim at the guy next to me. Boom. Both of them. He's gone. But I'm still behind this block. And really, I don't know if I even have to defeat this guy. I can just move on to the next thing, right? Rabbit Peach is within reach. Focus on getting to her now by moving to the tip of the manta's tail. All right. Will do. There you go. So the movement's a little more live action compared to the first game as far as my memory goes. Oh, she's gonna fight. Does she have a gun with the phone in it? Oh, they're not working. Uh oh. Touch egg to crack. Oh, tough egg to crack. <laughs> I misread it. Destroy Manta's weak points. Okay, got it. But do we have weapons? That's the real question here. I guess we'll find out soon. Rabbit Peach, you're safe! Despite the mysterious malevolent energy sabotaging our weapons! Yeah, that's bad that we don't have weapons. Neutralizing our weapons? Ha! We'll simply rely on our powerful dash move that has saved the day for us during many a battle. Alright, we'll dash. Using dash, we can jar those egg-like things loose once they're in your possession. You can throw them at the creature's orb-shaped eyeball protuberances. It's got it. Spots. Got it. Protuberances. Yes, got it. <laughs> Here we go. Who goes first? I'm streaming. I'm streaming. Me too. Hey. Uh, so we dash. How do you dash? All right. Pick up. So I can actually do multiple things at once. That's interesting. Here, then throw it. Got it. And I'm just going to... Uh, I, I don't know if I'm hidden well enough here, honestly. Can I... All right, we'll just stay here. We're good. How do we say we're done? Enemy turn is what it said. But I can also move up to Mario and do something as well. And then grab it. And then... So, yeah, this is a lot more live action-y than the, the, than the first one. I don't know how it determines how many things I can do at once, but I guess I'll hang out here and then give the enemy a turn. Why not? Yeah, I guess I, I have to pass a turn. Oh, there's a the guy there. Oh, so, okay, great. Great. The last weak point is beyond that gap. 
We'll need to find a way to get over it. Time for some team jumping. All right, team jumping. Uh, use a team jump to reach the last dark, dark mess, dark mess egg. <laughs> During a team jump, your heroes are free to move around while in the air. Just be aware of the timer. Gather your heroes close to the pl uh, to perform a team jump by standing still next to another hero. You can reveal their maximum team jump distance. When a hero enters into another hero's area of movement, this area will be highlighted in yellow, and the shoe icon for the ladder will be highlighted as well. Okay, we'll s we'll see this. So I do wonder about this creature. I'm just gonna move Mario over here, and I guess have Rabbit Peach do the team jump. This seems to work. So team jump. Uh. Awesome. Okay, got it. Yes, yeah, so I'm. I'm actually doing a lot of things at once. Goodbye. Oof. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. Nice recovery, Mario. <laughs> Not so much you, Rabbit Beach. <laughs> oh man, they're surrounding us. What do we do? Yeah, fix my gun. Their faces look so weird. Those are like the little star creatures from Super Mario Galaxy, right? The Lumas? But their faces are so... They're so rabid-fied, you know what I mean? Alright. Shot in the dark mess. Defeat all. Okay, got it. So this will be fun. So we got two things to do. I don't know... Have been reactivated. Time to take cover. Take aim and fire at those baddies. Just beware that this dimension works quite differently than our own. You cannot move after you shoot. Okay, that's a, that's an interesting change. Uh, so, who, who goes first? Okay, here we go. When an enemy is behind partial cover, you have a 50% chance to hit them. Percentages will appear along your intended line of fire. Some weapons can bypass partial cover to hit an enemy when they are behind them. Remember, after you shoot, you cannot move anymore during that turn, so be sure to take cover first. Okay, that's a good thing to know. So I'm over here, I'll take cover, and then I will shoot. So it's only a 50% chance of hitting them, so I'm just gonna shoot twice at this guy. Nope, <laughs> neither shot hit. Okay, that's fine though. Uh, let's switch over to Rabbit Peach. Now she has the ability, I guess, of uh, of shooting at him. Oh, nice, I got him, I got him. All right, now these guys, not gonna hit me, because I'm behind a solid block. Now he's gonna take cover right there. Oof, okay. So, uh, if I want, I can try to go over here and then just look around. One of those was a critical. And then switch over to Mario and I'm gonna move over here and just aim at him twice. <laughs> Man, missed again. Huh? All right, but he's out in the open, so really, I'm surprised he doesn't try to just dash. I wonder if he can dash. I can't dash, but I can still look at him and, and shoot him a couple times. All right, clear. What is this creature doing? Oh, we're getting back on. Goombas. Oh, wow. What is this? That is quite spooky. Does he recognize that eye or something? Like, hello, Goombas. Oh, 
Oh, wow. So they have control of those Goombas. Headlong into the unknown. Defeat all. All right. I can surely try that out. That vicious, horrible monster is Cursa. We barely escaped it. Now it won't stop chasing us, says the Starburst. So those aren't Lumas, those are Starbursts. No, this Cursa is well out of range. The energy readings I'm picking up from it are beyond my ability to measure. I, I can help. I can give Mario the ability to power up his attacks. It'll even have the same effect on his friends. We'll take all the help we can get. Mario, be sure to see what this new ability of yours can do. Speaking of abilities... I really don't remember if Beepo in the original game could talk with a voice. Maybe. Let me know in the comments below. Remember that both of you have your signature techniques at your disposal. I have a feeling you're going to need them. Oh, uh, we do have our signature techniques for sure. All right, here we go. Uh, defeat all. There's a lot of Goombas. Uh, now that you could choose between, uh, now that you could choose between attack techniques and sparks, remember that each hero has two action points per turn. Don't forget about dash. These movement abilities do not consume action points, but they have their own counters. To reach a better position, remember that you can use the team jump. Uh, it's a movement ability and does not consume action points, but they have their own counters. Let's go. All right, uh, so I could dash in all of these guys, right? Like this looks like a, a dash that I can just do everything, right? Awesome. And then, um, do I want to team jump from here? I don't think I do. I think I want to take cover. And I want to, so wait, what's, what the heck is, okay, so I gotta learn a bunch of stuff. What is this? Turbo charge, allies within range deal 20% more damage with attacks and movement abilities. Sure. Yes, uh, but I can still also shoot, which is interesting, but what's this ZR? Hero sight, targets moving within uh, range and the hero's line of sight are dealt. All right, so this would be if it moves. If that guy moves, he'll get shot. Okay, sure. Lock and load. <laughs> And then for her, uh, so he's used all of his points. Uh, for her now, I can actually move uh, all the way over here, which is interesting. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. I'm out in the open. Let's see if I can team jump and move. Uh, thanks. I wonder what happens if I fall into a pit. All right, great. And then I'm just gonna aim at this guy. That guy's out in the open, so he's gone. And, and plus, my uh, power was boosted, so I'm done. The enemy gets a turn. Well, let's see what this is. This is uh, health already full. It heals, but we don't need to do that. So let's give the enemy their turn. Go. They're moving. Oh, I only got one, though. Oh, well. That was pretty cool. But they all could have been got with a dash move. All right, they're trying. I didn't know the Goombas would be the things that move. Oof, okay. All right, so her. Yeah, I can take him out really quick. Oh, but I can only, I can't, okay, yeah. Hold on, can I dash into this guy? I can dash into this guy. Is he okay? <laughs> Is he all right? Uh, then let's just, over here, we will uh, aim at him. And he's gone. So let's switch to Mario. Mario is going to dash right there. Oh, dang it, I didn't line up. Oh no. Uh, okay, well. Only a 50% chance. Let's get rid of this Goomba. And him. Yeah, I missed him again. Alright, we we gotta we gotta just be done with that. I forgot to dash in a in a perfect line. Who's he gonna gonna try to get Mario? 50 50% chance? Miss me as well. 
Oh, but he has a shot too. Oh, whoa! <laughs> oh, that hit me. That's okay. So, uh, can I dash into both of these guys? I can. There you go. There you go. And then... I'm just, here, I'm just going to shoot you. <laughs> I can't move, but I don't need to move. And then now uh, she's going to dash into these. And this is lined up, right? Awesome. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Battle cleared. And we got XP. Okay, this is exciting. And coins and star bits. Play again? No. Next. Cursa, what are you doing? What is that? What the heck? Oh, it's Rabbit Mario and Rabbit, uh... Was that regular Luigi or Rabbit Luigi? I couldn't see. We're rescued. Cursa, don't touch me! All right. Great, we made it out. Awesome, now what happens? By the way, if you guys want to subscribe, now's the time. We'll get many more of these episodes out soon. Welcome, Mario and Rabbit Peach. It is fortunate that you are unharmed. Your safety is critical to our mission. Well, Mario was hit a little bit. Hey, hello. Remember me, the entity who created you? I'm alive, too. <laughs> also fortuitous, but with a critical success factor that is lower in comparison by 31.732193%. Okay, just round it. <laughs> Forgive Jeannie here for her arrogance, everyone. As the ship's new artificial intelligence, she just became self-aware yesterday. Oh, good. <laughs> Obviously, I have a lot more testing to do, but seeing as how we're an emergency situation here, I, uh... <laughs> All right. What do you want? Hey, little fella. <laughs> hey, little fella, aren't you sparkly? Did you come on board with Mario? Interesting. It appears that this creature is equal parts rabid and luma. Ah, see? It contains a massive amount of harnessable energy as a result. Great. I suspect there are more of them scattered throughout the galaxy, though without more data, the exact number cannot be determined. But we'll get more data soon, right? Hmm. How could this have happened? Rosalina would never have allowed this. Mama, she, she's in trouble because of Cursa. Please help her, please. Oh no, Rosalina, something terrible must have happened. Cursa is conquering the galaxy using a corruptive energy called Darkness. I can pinpoint the epicenter of this activity, Cursa's stronghold. Well, that's where we'll go. It will take our ship an eternity to travel the distance between our current location and the stronghold. We don't have that much time. However, using a purified form of darkness energy, we could create a series of warp tunnels that would make such travel almost instantaneous. Nice. Just what I was about to suggest to our friend here. Hmm, what do we call your kind? Aha! How about Rabid Lumas? That sounds good to me, but I think they already had a name. Sparks. <laughs> really? Because objectively speaking, I think Rabbit Loomis is kind of perfect, no? I think it's good. Blech. It stinks, says Rabbit Mario. The closest planet within range is Beacon Beach. The dark mess has already spread there. Not enough data to define the level of danger. Please, Genie, adventure may be new to you, but not to <laughs> us. I expect the level of difficulty of this mission to be... Uh, average? <laughs> of course I reserve the right to change my mind at any point during our mission. No, we'll stick with average. <laughs> Regardless, with the rabid Loomis behind us, the rocky road ahead will be made just a little smoother. I believe the consensus was Sparks. Okay, they're called Sparks now. No, whatever. What matters is we have their help. Listen, now that Cursor knows they're with us, I bet it will never bother us again. <laughs> Never ever. Oh, jeez. Oh, man.
man. I need the energy of those creatures. Bring them to me. Okay. Oh, dear. Are those bosses coming out? It could be. Well, let's see what happens to this first planet, then. Oh, wow. This place looks pretty awesome. And this is where we're landing, right? Is that a flux capacitor? <laughs> no. All right, Mario is here. Oh, the dark mess everywhere. Blah. Oh, dear. I wonder if we get to choose our party at all. What the heck? Oh, hey. Out, out, out. It's Augie. Out, out, out. If you're here to cause trouble, we're at our limit already. Put that away. We're heroes, not unruly tourists. Exactly. Heroes? You mean like the put yourselves in serious danger to help total strangers kind of heroes? I don't quite have his voice. Bingo, bingo, bongo, baby. Augie's gonna... <laughs> got a prayer. <laughs> um... <laughs> Yeah, uh, <laughs> what, what I mean is, I've got some minor problems I could use help with. See that thing on our lighthouse? It is a big thing. The sun My disappeared goodness. the second it showed up and snuffed out our lighthouse signal fire. That thing is a dark mess tentacle. By eliminating it, not only can we reverse its ill effects on the weather, but we can purify its dark mess energy and use it to create a warp tunnel to our next destination. Well, that sounds perfect. We must also eradicate any and all dark mess puddles. They won't yield purified dark mess energy, but they are still a threat. Okay. Got to get rid of the darkness. Oh. Um, can you also. also, can you stop by the village first? It's under siege by a horrible menace. Been meaning to get it on it for a while. Aki's <laughs> request is compatible with our mission. I have detected a spark in the village as well. We should make contact. All right. Well, only if it's compatible. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff here. I don't know what's spark? going on. Spark. Spark. That's what. That, that's what you call those ill. Those little star-shaped critters. Sigh. They could have done both of us a favor and stayed home too. Well, we're all here. Trouble in a village sounds like a two hero job, not including myself, of course. Easy as pie. Let's get it over with before my nano dials start to rust. Who's with me? All right, who is with you? Do I get to choose? Okay, new main quest unlocked. You just unlocked your first quest. Let's check them on our map. Uh, okay, so we have a map. Uh, here's the next step of our main quest. Uh, to check all available quests, press X at any time to open your quest log. All right, so there's the ship. There's a lot of stuff here. So the main quests. Okay, level four. Okay, I got you. I got you. So this is like level two. Where's level one? Level two. Did we already do level one on that Manta? Or hold on, what's over here? Level two. Oh, no, the level two just telling us the difficulty, I guess. Red coin challenge. Beacon Beach Secret Zone. The darkness outside the lighthouse. So I guess these are just saying a level 10. The Goomba with the pot on its head. That's interesting. So there's a map. There's memories. Hello, world. Uh, the Trans Rabbelator. Oh, wow. So these are these are memories. Okay, okay. Interesting. We could read these. Uh, so... Initializing existence confirmed. Convincing self-diagnostic. I am genie. Jovial electronic artificial uh, neuronic <laughs> intelligent elite. Uh, the operating system of the new rabbit spaceship, the WM Arc. My creator is Bebo, a primitive robot intelligence who made, oh dear, 7,685,546 errors during my initial design. Yeah, yeah, we get a lot of errors. There, all fixed. 
uh, the Trans Rabulator. After the events of the Megabug, Beepo saw the need for an adaptive omnilinguistic assistant to translate Rabidese. After declaring it far better when he did not know what they were thinking, he pivoted to, cre to create an adaptive AI operating system to pilot the hero's spaceship, and so created me. Uh, Beepo may look like a short-tempered, self-guided vacuum cleaner, but I am in his debt. Oh, there's audio. Oh, I don't have to read them. Initializing. I got Existence it. Confirmed. <laughs> Commencing. All right, we got it. We got it. So I read this one. Let's read. Let, let. After an exhaustive analysis of our brave Spark allies, I can confirm that they are what they appear to be: a fusion of Luma and Rabid. The Spark's memories as to how exactly this came to be are lost to them. Yet two instincts remain: their affection for their mama, Rosalina, and their deep fear of Cursa who pursues them relentlessly throughout the galaxy in hopes of seizing their tremendous power for itself. All right. Probes and memories. Beepo, with help from his friend Spawny, launched informational probes to gather extensive data on every planet in the galaxy. None returned, as their turtle-like oh. shape makes them impossibly slow. Their findings will have to be manually retrieved. Luckily, I was given the tools to do so. I am intrigued to find out more about the galaxy, and perhaps my place in it. All right, the story so far. Shortly after defeating the Megabug, the heroes disbanded. Some remained at Peach's castle to help her manage the rabbits there and build a new spaceship. With the sudden arrival and then disappearance of the Dark Miss Manta, who took with it Mario, Beepo, and Rabbit Peach, I gathered the remaining heroes and executed a rescue mission. For which I have yet to hear people <laughs> say thank you. <laughs> All right. I am quite pleased with our spaceship, the WM Ark, washing machine advanced rabbit carrier. Its engine systems adapted well to using purified darkness energy to create warp tunnels. The armory has proven to be efficacious, and the cutting edge hollow deck invaluable. Am I the only one who regards our spaceship as home? Or do some of the heroes feel this way as well? I mean, it's our home away from home, right? So missing memory file progression-wise, Beacon Beach is only 3% done. Uh, so I guess, okay, so weapon skins, memories, planet keys. So there's going to be a lot of memories. Holy cow. Um, but I don't know. Okay, this, okay, so a lot of memories in total. But we'll get through to those eventually. Let's go over here. So we now know where we need to go. Uh, multiple weapon skins obtained. You just obtain your first weapon skin, open the weapon skin page to check it out and equip it. So how do I do that? Okay, down to open the tin. Okay, heal your entire party for a few coins. There is a service offered by SalesBot999 plus TX, the merchant. Visit him. He has some very interesting items to sell. All right, so straight up. Can I talk to this guy? Hey, bud. Hey, bud. I don't want to sound ungrateful, but do we have a timetable on that lighthouse cynical situation? <laughs> Folks have this weird don't idea I control the sun and I can make it rise whenever I want, mostly because I told them I could. All right. That is a bad thing. Uh, hey, a few coins here. So before we go on, though, I, I do want to backtrack just a little bit. See if I uh, see what I can see about like this merchant or whatever. There's stuff down here. There's all sorts of stuff around. Travel. I don't want to travel, but how do I pull up the... This is the down thing to heal. I don't think so. Uh, what's what's this? Okay, this is the... These are my two guys, but I also have these people. I don't know if I can... How, can I arrange the party differently? I can, I, can, I can swap, but for now, we'll stick with these two. Sparks. Items. It looks like there's nothing here. You could buy items. I don't know how to do the oh, weapon skins. There we go. So I have these from, like, I guess the bonus or whatever. Galactic triple. Equip it. Sure. And then Mario will equip his as well. Okay, they all have different weapons. So I'll just keep these two. I don't know where I got them. Um, okay. I, I can... Okay. Let's just... I. I do also want to just get on with it. I don't know where the merchant is. Travel. Um, okay, let's just pr progress onwards. Oh, is that the merchant over there? No. This is the big thing to look at. I don't know how long it would take to clear this thing out. But uh, let's go forth. 
I can walk across this water, I hope. What is this? Oh, wow. What just happened? I dashed into him and thus, are we gonna fight? Is that basically like a, a guy that we're fighting? What is happening? I literally don't know what's happening right now. I mean, that was a cool sequence, but why? <laughs> oh, this is a fight. I just stumbled onto a fight. I guess. Manage your team. Let's check the team management menu inside. You can choose who to bring. Okay. Who do I want to bring? Uh, you can browse. Okay. I, I mean, I'm, I'm happy with these two for now. I don't know why I would switch at the moment, but let's just stick with these two. Oh my gosh. Who am I fighting? Oh, I could also flee if I wanted to. Let's just do it. Uh, dash, pick up and throw ba-bombs to deal damage in the area. Okay, got it, got it, got it. So where are ba-bombs? All right, so the, so I saw a ba-bomb. Oh, crap. Wait, can I pick him up? Pick up. He has a timer. All right. Uh, I can also just dash into them straight up, right? No. I cannot. Uh, but I, I can just be out in the open, right? Point blank. All right, that's okay. It's okay that I'm out in the open because I can switch. She can dash. Oh, there's four. Where's the fourth guy? Oh no, the the bomb counter is one. That's a, that's a really close shot. All right, they're 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 gone, right? All right, so that was just a battle. I I got into the middle of a battle there. I'm all about personal growth. And we all leveled up. That's great news. Okay, and so. I didn't realize what that was when I stumbled upon it, but skill prism obtained. You just unlocked your first skill prisms. You can use them in the skill tree to empower your heroes. Let's take a look at that. Uh, okay, health, movement, weapon, technique. This is your skill tree. It's used to upgrade your hero's abilities during battles. Skill prisms are the currency you can spend to activate upgrades. Each hero has their own set of skill prisms. They can be used and refunded at any time without cost. You can find the skill tree inside the heroes tab. All right, great. So we each have one. So for Mario, his health up would be a good thing. Glide boost, increase the glide time after Mario performs a team jump. And uh, this one is critical hit chance, weapon range. Hero sight damage is fun. Can I upgrade the range now or does it take two? How does it work? Oh, yeah, so it it takes, okay, I got it. I don't know. Okay, so I guess to fully upgrade it, I would do, I, I would need one more. All right, well, we'll come back once we get one more. Mm -hmm. And then we'll uh, maybe be able to do some full upgrades. All right, so that was interesting for sure. Oh, there's the vendor, right? There's so much stuff going on. Get some coins. Please help us. Our village is under siege. Press X to run to the plaza. And this is the vendor, right? Big flash sale going on. Do to my audiovisual capacitors deceive me? Or do I see some discerning customers with an eye for quality here? My usual customers, they have what I call value blindness. For them, I put out factory returns, overstock items. Still, they do nothing but haggle over price and badger me over reward points. Me, with six little peddler bots at home, I can't afford to buy them all shoes, so they have to share. But do I complain? No. I continue to offer amazing deals, such as first-time Beacon Beach customers get two free super mushrooms. My loss is your gain, but after this, if you want a full team heal, anytime you'll need to pay, uh, or anytime except combat. All right, check your item bag. All right, one item per turn can be used. So these are just items. Uh, okay, I don't necessarily want to buy... Oh, oh, I could buy memories, which is interesting. 
Uh, and th these cost. Oh, okay, so to buy memories, I need. Okay, I gotcha. I gotcha. I only have 244. I need completion to buy some of these potions. Okay. Wow. Okay. Okay, let's just move on. I'm glad you're here. Where the heck do I go? Let's find out. Because I am. Uh, I feel like I'm killing a lot of time. I don't mean to. Okay, so. Uh, let's look at the map. How do I look at the map? Is this the map button? All right, great. Main quest in deep water, side quest, okay. Map, memories, all right. This was the first one that we ran into, right? Yeah, in deep water, save big So this is like a main mission that we gotta do. The rest are side quests, which we'll do as well. And this is the merchant, okay, I got it, I gotcha. All right, so. Let's go over here to, uh, in deep water to save Beacon Town. And how do we get up there? Let's press X to sprint. So this looks like it. This looks like a main mission, right? Help, help! Uh oh. Uh oh. Huh? Blah. Blah. <laughs> This is the bomb. Get away from us. Slow motion dash. <laughs> Are we okay? All right, so let's see what's happening here. Explosive situation. There's a lot of the bombs. Defeat all and how many are there? There seems to be a lot. Um, okay, heal your team, manage your team. Here we go, I'm, I'm good with this. So I'm guessing to defeat all, we're going to, yeah, so I'm gonna go grab this guy, dash dash into him, then, then I'll be able to pick him up. Yeah, this seems solid, right? There you go. And then, how do I shoot the guy on top? Maybe she can, I don't know if I can. I'm gonna just gonna be right here. And then I'm just gonna shoot. Excellent. All right. Um, and then, you know what? Yeah. If anyone, if anyone moves in my range, they're gonna get hero sighted. I thought I put on new skins. Oh, I did, but they just don't show up in the cutscene. Okay. Uh, then let's see here. Oh, I can't really, I'm, I might have to team jump if I, well actually no, let me just be right here. All right, there you go, I got the top guy. And then uh, it's the enemy's turn now. Now, get out of here. <laughs> All right, there's this guy left, I don't know. This is the last one, right? Toodles. Toodles. All right, that was pretty straightforward. And then we got coins, star bits. I don't want to. I don't want to play again. So that was a main story mission, right? Nice work getting rid of that babam. I was worried <laughs> there's several of them. I was worried to kaboom the poor creature I found. All right, there's a lighthouse. See that door to the lighthouse can only be unlocked by the sun. With it gone, we can't get inside normally. Lucky for you, this clever little critter can make its own light. Watch, I'll show you. So this is one of these uh, rabbit, rabbit lumas. It looks scared. What is it doing? Oh, okay. Oh, it's rising. <laughs> okay, a little bit of light. 
Now, why'd you go in there? Into the Sunrise Temple. All right, that's, a, that's the next main quest here, is into the Sunrise Temple. That poor spark of light got spooked and flew that way. Sigh, I really thought we'd bonded too. What's in here? I can explore the realm. What is this? My grandpa's cellar is full of secrets. There's a locked chest down there too and a strange door too. All right, uh, let's see. Uh, I'm a little, is this like a side quest? What is this? Oh, interesting, climb down. So I'm glad I explored. What is this? Move. Oh, move the, yeah, move that, get out of here. Nope, stop, stop moving it. Stop it, stop it. <laughs> Basement treasures, planet coin awarded, okay. All right, so I just did a little side thing, okay. Well, I'm glad I looked around. I, I don't know like how much I'm gonna have to look around here to fully explore everything. Whatever was in that chest is yours. There's enough clutter around this house. So wait, was there also a chest? Did I misunderstand the situation? Hold on, there, I did see a chest. No, that's a barrel. So they, they say that's a chest. What is this door? This like is like, there's something behind here, dude. I swear. All right, well, okay, I, I'll, I'll keep it. Let's go up, 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 and then we'll we'll get out of here. So this is definitely really interesting. Um, I wonder what's what's going on. Whoa, yeah, look, look what is that? Oh, fuzzy wuzzy was it though? His imaginary friend <laughs> slash pet. They had an argument, and now they're not speaking. Huh. Well, I wonder, can I go through this door, this room, this building, house, whatever it is. All right, what's up with you? I sure hope you can save Beacon Beach. It used to be such a nice planet before that awful darkness appeared. Can I interact with anything, hey, yeah. anything here at all? I don't think so. Okay, so this is just a little, okay. I do wonder like how many things will show up on the map or how much exploration I'm gonna have to do uh, separate of that. What is this? There's a flag here. Beacon Town flag, you just discovered a new teleport flag. Open the map menu to use it to fast travel all around the planet. Oh, do I gotta pick those up too? I'll take them, I'll take them. There's a tree, okay, so don't forget to shake the trees. Okay, coins just hanging out here. So yeah, exploring definitely pays off. Uh, at least it seems that way. There is a light activated lock on the lighthouse door, but with these clouds covering the sun, it won't work. Uh, nothing happened there. Oh wow, okay. So let's go do one more stage at least, and uh, then we'll see. I mean, wow, what is going on around here? This is, there's so much to look at. I'm, I'm getting overwhelmed. Oh wow, what's this? This is locked. I wonder if I can buy a key. What's that sound? Oh, this is a dark mess. Okay. Definitely this is gonna take uh, uh, some exploration overall. Did I go in this one? I don't think I did. So let's go in this one. And find out what we can find. I wonder if it'll be harder to get 100% completion here. What's up, dude? I was resigned to living with a bomb bomb outside my door forever. Thank you for getting rid of it. So this one doesn't seem to have anything either as far as I could tell. Huh. Okay. Okay. I'm not trying to waste anyone's time here. I'm just trying to be thorough. So, looking at the map though, we can go to the next, uh, into the Sunrise Temple. This is in deep water main quest. Into the Sunrise Temple. So looking at the map, the Sunrise Temple is all the way over here. This looks new. But bomb hunt, no, I, that, that means, wait, that's not, okay. 
So many things to do here, guys. Okay, this is exciting. But we'll, we'll do one more. We'll go over here in deep water. I can't fast travel there, but we know how to get there. We just... It's way over there. Jump down, sure. And then... Uh, that creature flying towards the temple was luminescent. i never seen anything like it. What does this guy do? But bombs ruin everything. So I would talk to him probably to start a side quest. Which is fine. I can do that soon. But I want to do the main thing first. If that makes sense. Is someone chasing me? I think someone's chasing me. There's red. There was red. I don't know what happened. Okay, so... I think to wrap up today's episode, we will do this. Uh, crossing the battleground. Here we go. Let's find out what we can do. All right, reach area. So we just have to reach the area, which is actually easier than fighting, I think. You gotta win this battle so I can leave with you, else I'm stuck here. That's you Pyro know, Star. We were following a different spark earlier, but <laughs> the more the merrier. <laughs> that guy looks a little, little evil. <laughs> Here's a tip, the bad guys in this particular battlefield are pretty apathetic. Get to the other end of the battlefield and they'll give up. All right, this is great. So by pressing, he's, he's able to move around the, the battlefield, analyze both heroes and enemies. Okay, great. And you okay, each time you encounter new enemies, remember to analyze them. It will help you understand their abilities and behaviors. So I could have Beepo here. He knows those, right? So he knows these. Okay. Okay, okay. Burn and frost. They're resistant to frostbite. Okay, I don't think I have that right now anyway. So, uh, one question I have immediately is, you know, if we take a look at our team, is there anyone who has better movement than what we have now? So this would be really interesting to find out. Um, so sneak attacker, pest, protector, brawler. How do you find out more about them? Uh, does it show movement at all? More info. Uh, <laughs> I honestly don't know. I don't know how to view their movement abilities. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. We'll just, uh, what's Sparks? What do we got here? Reserve Sparks, Attack Master. Who is that? Oh, I guess Luigi has that one. Upgrade. I can't upgrade this, can I? Can I upgrade this? Oh, I can give him star bits. Oh, that makes sense. Um, But we'll, we'll just leave it for now because it seems pretty easy. We're good. Here we go. Let's go. I'm going to dash these guys. Okie dokie. And then I'll just be right here because the Goombas can't reach me from here. And the enemies are pretty relaxed, right? So let's go ahead and switch over. I'll do a team jump. I'll dash these guys. And then I'll, I'll stay here. I don't think I can reach anybody. Oh, I can. Hold on, can I reach? I don't think I can reach those guys, though. Those, those guys are just out of range. All right, forget it. Forget it. We're good. Enemies get a turn, but they're pretty passive, so we'll see what happens. Can he reach me? Oh, no. Oh, no. My bad. I thought they were going to be passive. Oh, don't worry. She has a heal ability, so... Um... So I'm just gonna dash into these guys. Ah! Oh, satisfying. Oh, satisfying. Okay, uh, and then let me just uh -huh. heal myself with my phone. <laughs> and then you know what? I'm gonna target you. He's still alive, but that's okay. 
Switch over to Mario. I don't know how much movement I actually have. Not much. And then I, I think we'll just give the enemy their turn. I don't think I can do much else. Oof. All right. Well. Missed. Good, 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 good. I think that she could just run it in now, right? No, she can't. All right, well, Mario can do what? I could do a, a team a team what? jump. There we go. Battle clear. We don't have to fight those guys. And we level up to three, which is awesome. Everyone leveled up. I like that everyone levels up. That really helps me. All right, so did we get a new thing? Pyrostar joins the team. A new spark just joined your team. Equip it in the spark menu and have it ready to fight alongside your heroes. All right, so let's take a look at what that means to equip a new spark. Py uh, this is the spark management screen. You can assign any spark that joined your team to any one of your heroes. All weapon-based attacks are, uh, are, are charged with burn super effect. Deal 120% damage. Okay, burn protector. All super effect damage is reduced by 20%. Heroes are not affected by burn super effect. So, great. Uh, I can also upgrade him, but I, I'm okay. Let's give him to Rabbit Peach. Wait, wait, hold on. How do I do that? There you go. Got it. All right, we're good. And then we follow the Spark of Light. All right, great. Skill Prism obtained. And then let's enter this. <laughs> oh, whoa, what is he? Oh no. He's like, I'm just gonna go down here. I won't say a word. Something is following me down here. I don't know what to make of this. Follow the spark of light. So this is a fast travel flag. Temple entrance flag. So, man, these stages are way bigger than I expected. Can't go in there. This is pretty interesting. Oh, wow. I'm following him. I'm trying to, but he's getting away from me. There, I saw the spark of light. It went over that big old crevice. Oh my goodness. Hmm. Perhaps we can cross over it without blank, but we need to raise the water level there somehow. So let's just go forward then and see how we trigger this mission here. There's a, there's a, what is this, move? Is it like a puzzle? What are we, oh my gosh. What the heck? Oh, it is kind of like a puzzle. We're trying to make a path here. I guess a path that'll... No, no. Let go. Let go. <laughs> I think we are. We're trying to move the water. There we go. That's what we're doing here. Okay. And then this should be relatively easy, right? Where does this one go? Can I... I can just pull it, right? I don't have to push it. I can, I can pull it a certain way. And then this one probably moves this way. And then this one maybe moves forward. Oh, I... Can't move it forward. Maybe this one can move. There, that one. Okay, there you go. Well, no, we had it. We had it. There we go. Move this one now. And now the water will flow. Oh no, it won't. Cause this thing, <laughs> this thing's here. Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, we got it. We got it. Where does this go? Oh my gosh, I'm so confused. I thought I, I thought I had the puzzle solving skills ready. Oh no. I literally don't know where this can go now. Um, yep. There we go. Just had to move it over a little bit. And now the wheels are turning. Tons of water flowing. We're going to fill this up, make a bridge. I don't know if there was a, a fight there or what, but uh, let's go. I don't think there is a fight here. There's a painting, though. Well, we, we, let's look at the first painting first. That way we'll get them in order. Let's see. What does this say? By age 10, Augie's brother was the patron deity of effortless victories, epic love poems, and glistening six-pack abs. 
Oh, that's that's good. Age 10, huh? That's a little early. Let's see what this... Uh, whoa, something's up there. I don't quite know what that is. Let's see what this says. The only trophy Augie won as a child was for second place in a Broadworth eating contest. Not even first. Dang. Oh, there's some Goombas here, which I imagine is a side thing. Oh, no. Go, 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 go. I don't want to... Oh, he ran into me first. Okay, so I probably should have encountered him first. Maybe I would have gotten some sort of benefit from it. Uh, but we'll see as we go in here. I don't think this is a this is a main story. This is just a defeat all thing. I bet... So I can back out of this, right? If I wanted to. Like, if I really wanted to, I could back out of this. But, yeah, we could flee. But I'd rather not. I'd rather just go ahead and defeat all 19... We should be good. Let's -a go. So let's -a go. Ah! Oh yeah. And then if I hide behind here, I can actually switch and I could maybe do a team jump and then get in the way. Here, come on, team jump. Ah! All right, right here, right here. Ah! Love it. Love it. Now Here's the real question. If I do I want to just go back here? And if I do, is it fine to just shoot? Let's let's shoot over here. Oh, there's a guy. There's a guy. Hold on. All right, all right. And then what about uh Mario then? Mario can uh well, no. You know what? I'm just going to stay here. I'm going to pass the turn. These enemies are coming in. Oh, they're all in one line. That's great. That's great news. Will those line up eventually? I don't know. This guy. I don't know if this guy can even see us. Oh, he can. No, he can't. Never mind. All right. Mario gets to move. I'm going to go ahead and... Can I dash into all of these guys? No, I can't. Dang. Dang. Uh, okay. I'm just gonna kind of hide over here then. I don't know if I can target him. I have a 0% chance of shooting, but maybe I could destroy the block. There you go. Alright. Then, um, let's move her. She's gonna hit these Goombas. I, I haven't quite figured out how important it is to do... Oh man, those Goombas are probably gonna reach me. I'm gonna just go right over here then, and then uh, shoot him. Oh, he might be dead, he might be dead. Nice, and now it's just the Goombas left, so we'll give them a turn. Oh, oh gosh, oh my gosh. All right, all right, that's, that's fine. I'm gonna grab these three, then Mario can grab these three. There we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So battle complete. We got an ambush, but we got it. And then uh, let's keep following this thing underground. There's seems like multiple. Can I go across here? No, this is blocked up. But that, that gives me a good view into the area. Here's another poster to check out. The ocean is said to have been formed by the tears of Perfectus's hairdressers, who wept with joy while brushing his golden mane. No. <laughs> All right, coins are good. What is this? This is glowing. What do I do with this? Okay, I hit the wrong button. Can I somehow use? I don't know what button to push to, to look at this. This is something. Hey, what's up, guys? For the dough to rise, eight hours to knead, and after licking the cinnamon glaze off, Augie tosses it aside. <laughs> More for the rabbit. Well, what is this? Doesn't anyone want to know what this is? How do I figure it out? I'm pushing all the buttons. I literally don't know what to do. All right, let's see. Oh, here, here's another poster. Augie's first job was to help sailors in distress. This mural is called Sentinel of the Seas. Oh boy. Oh boy, indeed. Um. 
Oh, and the merchant is here too. That's interesting. I don't feel like I need anything, but I'm glad he's here. He's following me around. But over here is the next part of the story. Uh-oh. It's okay. We're approaching you, but it's okay. He's happy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh oh. It's a big dark mess over there. I think is this gonna be a boss fight? Hurry! We've got to go after that spark of light! Do we go in or do what do Indeed. we Indeed. Without the spark, we will not be able to enter the lighthouse. <laughs> Gee, that is far from the only reason we should save the poor creature. <laughs> Trying to teach her morals now. Obviously. Defeating the Darkness Tentacle will also provide us with one of two purified Darkness energy crystals we need. Okay, okay. That's However, the other reason. <laughs> this creature's higher density of darkness energy, as compared to puddles, means our enemies will be more formidable. Okay. <sighs> That's what I get for buying you an off-the-shelf AI empathy module to save time. <laughs> yeah, she doesn't care. All right, triumph over the darkness tentacle. Sounds like a good plan. Uh, I don't have full health, but I guess I could switch characters if I really needed to. Um, but let's see what's what's up here. I don't mind sticking with these two for the moment. But we should maybe switch just for some variety, am I right? So maybe we could bring in Luigi and Rabbit Mario. They don't have the same guy. Super effects can be applied to potentially anyone generating unique behaviors. Here, the burn super effect sets its target alight. Okay. Super effects are useful against enemies if you take care to avoid their resistances and exploit their weaknesses. For example, uh, the scoper is weak against burn. Equip one of your heroes with Pyrostar might equip, equip one of your heroes with Pyrostar might be might then be a good strategical move. Always remember to use your tactic cam by pressing L to check your enemy's weaknesses and resistances. So that's a great idea. Let's use the tactical cam. What is this? I don't know. But this thing right here is weak to burn. Uh, what what the heck? Where am I? Weak to burn. So many things are weak to burn. Oh no no, no. these guys the Stooges don't. But the scoop scopers the Stooges. Nothing, but the scope are weak to burn. Okay, great. Good to know. Um, let me switch to Luigi. Why not, right? Mario's fine, but he's a little damaged. <laughs> so let's switch to Luigi. I can heal my team, but let's switch to Luigi. I'd rather just manage the team. And then uh, Rabbit Peach will stick around because she has that Luma. Obviously, we could probably switch. We could do Luigi here. Uh, he's got the Reflector level 1. Um... All right, Luigi's fine. We could switch to regular Peach instead of uh, Rabbit Peach, I guess, just to just to spice things up a little bit. I don't know. She's a protector, not a healer. A pest protector brawler. Hmm. Let's switch it just for fun. We'll look at the sparks, and then if I can switch these around, I can swap this and put it on Princess Peach. Could be interesting to see how this plays out. I don't know why there's a load screen. Here we go. We got to load the models in, I bet. Here we go. Let's see what's up. Can't stop Ouija. Can't stop Ouija. So let's switch to Peach temporarily and try to use this uh, burn attack. All weapon-based attack deal burn damage. All right, great. So that's going to be what I use. Because we're gonna, going to attack this guy first. I'm going to go right here. And if I'm here, can I aim at him? I can. Oh, this is the Boombrella. Bur burst one wave at the targets. The farther it uh, the travels, the less damage. Uh, it deals ignore partial cover. So if I if I want, one thing I could do is I could I can't dash into him, but maybe Luigi can dash into him. And so yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and do this. Just uh, target and go. Wow. 
Oh no, it set Luigi on fire. They are just all right, all right, all right, good. Luigi, hopefully, will be able to just dash into him and end him. Uh, boom. And then press this. Use this. Does using something in my turn, or does this? Oh, wow. Let's see how much closer I can get. And then if I'm here, you know, I can also... Uh, what does my guy do? 20% of the damage intended for the hero is redirected towards the enemy. That's That's fine. I feel like that'd be something good to give to Peach, but whatever. And then ZR would be if anyone moves. Steely stare. Oh, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> I'm ready. I'm ready. And then I can't really use this because it's already been done. She's stuck here, so now it's the enemy's turn. Oh yeah. You move. <laughs> we. <laughs> we. <laughs> All right. All right, so I'm gonna try to super jump her. So I can kind of go over this way, I think. And then um, I want to, I guess target you. Such a powerful shotgun effect. And then what does this do? This does a team barrier. Go ahead, use the team barrier with my umbrella. The Brella as a shotgun kind of reminds me of Splatoon. And then Luigi's gonna move. He can't, he could do a super jump, but I don't really know why I would do a super, actually I know why. I, I would do a super jump. And then I would try to go over here so I could dash into one of these guys. And then I could also, I know this is, this is ridiculous, but sure. I'm super close to this other guy. Anyway, give the enemies their turn. He's gonna move, probably attack me, honestly. Oh, this guy, can he shoot me? Oh, no! Oh, no, I didn't know, he was so far away. Oh, but, oh, I blocked it. That's right, I blocked it. That's right, I blocked it. The protector. Oh, this one blocked, oh, that one doesn't block it, that's okay. All right, Luigi, here we go. This is gonna be great. We're gonna just uh, dash into you, you're gone. And then I'm going to super jump off of you, right? Team jump is what it's called. Then I can press this over here. Whoa. There we go. And then, yeah, I'm, I'm fine right here, but am I? I can reach you and you're gone. You're just gone. Boom. <laughs> oh yeah. The peach, what can you do? I can move you here. I don't know if I can even aim, no. Not in range, that's a shame. Anything in range over here? You're in range, no you're not. Dang. All right, well forget about it. Forget about it, we're just gonna leave it. Uh, actually, can I, maybe I can super jump off of Luigi. No, I cannot. All right, we're just gonna be here, it's fine. Enemies get their turn. What's he gonna do? All right, uh, fair enough. What are you gonna do, little dude? Oh, you can target Luigi now. Dang, got me. Oh, there's another one. All right. Well, the great news here. Um, let me switch to Luigi. I'll do a super jump off of her. Hold on. Team jump is what it's called. I don't know, I don't know why I keep calling it super jump, but. Dash into him, and then furthermore, point blank arrow shot into him, and then I'll just do my uh, my steely stare so that I can uh, target anyone who <laughs> dares to move an inch. And then uh, Peach's turn, I could do. I, you know, I don't. I don't really want to do a super jump. Can I shoot him from here? I can, but it's not very much. Oh, there's only a five percent chance. What if I'm over here? Can I shoot him a little bit better? That's not gonna hit him at all. Darn. Well, uh, let's do the burn effect for next turn or whatever. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave it here. 
Darn. Okay, well, enemy turn. We're moving in closer. It's okay. Don't you move. Nice. He's in the open. The rock's gone. Oh, there's two guys over there. I don't even know. Can they even shoot me from there? My shotgun. All right. He's going to probably try something. Missed. All right. So, can I actually dash into him? If I can just dash into him, that's perfect. Boom. Oh yeah, I can't move after that. Luigi's turn then. Can I use this and then move? I think I can, but that gives them the opportunity to move too. Crap. Uh, let's see. Well, hmm. This seems like a decent spot, but I feel like if he really wanted to reach me. I can't really aim with anyone there. I can get him though. Alright. I'm stuck here. But I can do this, which is to reflect. So that way if anyone tries to shoot Luigi. Yeah. Alright, give the enemy their turn now. He can move. Oof. But some of it reflects back at him, which is cool. Missed. All right, so I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna jump and push even closer. Dang, really? Okay, well. That's only a 50% chance. What about over there with this guy? Dang. Okay, well, we gotta hope that this works. <laughs> this is not, it's not going great, honestly. Uh, that won't hurt Luigi, will it? Nope. Uh, all right, ZR, we'll we'll protect a team barrier. I don't know. I don't know if that will reach Luigi at all. Luigi's in trouble, I think. All right, give the enemy their turn. This, he's so close. He's actually retreating, which is good. I thought he was gonna come at me. Oof. All right, the other guy. Man, Luigi's taking a thrashing. Uh, right. All right, let me do this. Let me see about the burn attack again. There you go. Don't come over here, please. Awesome. And then Luigi, I'm gonna go ahead and... Uh, I mean, I'm gonna try this. Missed, darn. I guess I'll do this in case he moves. Steely stare, I don't know if I can skip past this. Yeah, I can, we, we've seen it though. It's a cool, it's a cool view. Ah, Luigi is almost dead. Are you gonna move? He's not even gonna move. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna move over to here. That might hit, might not. Did not, but now he's exposed. Yeah, go ahead and do a reflect just in case things get really bad and he targets Luigi again. All right, and then uh, her turn. Uh, okay, I'm gonna get over here then. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna protect myself even better. <laughs> okay, this is taking a while. Here's your turn. What's he gonna do? All right, fair enough. Fair enough. No target in range. Uh, here, I'm gonna jump. 
because I want her protected a little bit better. Actually, she doesn't need to be as protected as much. There you go. Then Luigi's gonna move over here. Ah oh, man, how come that won't do the full trick? Can they get a critical or something? I don't know. No critical, darn. That means I have to give the enemy their turn. All right, well, fine. Where's he gonna go? Where's he gonna go? He's just gonna shoot at Dang, Luigi's almost dead. <laughs> oh no. You know what, but you're almost dead. Now we didn't have to fight all of them like that. I think we just had to reach the end, right? <laughs> but still got him. Need to heal Luigi. I'm glad I used him, but he needs to heal. Uh-oh. They're chasing him. Let go. Fight back. Whoa, awesome. That was pretty cool. Hey! Oh no, they got him cornered. Shine bright. Whoa. What the heck was that? Who is this? <laughs> Who is that? <laughs> is she on our team? Everyone's in love. Cut him down. Offering a hand. So this is a good guy. I thought this was a bad guy, be, you know, before she entered here. <laughs> oh, geez. Wow. What is this? Oh, wow. That's a ferocious tiger of some sort. Driven to the edge. Defeat giant wild claw. Okay, so this is our first boss fight. Assuming we can trust the ominous stranger, having three heroes cooperating on the battlefield would give a huge advantage. Ominous stranger is the name. So I'm going to definitely manage my team and bring in different people. Uh, instead of Luigi, believe it or not, I'm going to bring in Mario. <laughs> so, this is Edge, okay? Locked. But we can select uh, Mario. Let's bring Mario back in, even though Mario has taken some damage. We can actually bring in uh, Rabid Mario. Massive damage at close range. I don't know how close we're going to be able to get to him. So, actually, I'll probably just bring out Mario as an all-rounder. And then Peach was actually pretty good. But the but I, I don't know about the range. Let's see about Rabid Luigi as a pest. This could be good. Uh, diminishing enemies by reducing their damage they're capable of dealing out. I don't know. What do you think? Sure. Let's bring let's bring out a pest. And then uh, spark wise, you know, we could definitely use uh, that. Sure. Okay, I'm good. Let's uh, let's make the effort and fight this boss now. Here we go. So this is a close range weapon already, so I'm glad I didn't bring in something else that's close. Uh, but what is ZR? This is a storm blade. All targets within range are dealt 140% uh, damage plus any super effects if any one of them moves within the line of sight. That could be cool. I almost want to get into more protection though, but let's go Let's go back. Let's see, what, what does the Luma do? Allies within range take less damage, including super effects. That's just me for now. 
So let, let's actually move the allies within range then. That, that's within range, right? Yeah, then Mario will move within range as well. And then I can actually do edges uh, less damage thing, right? Wrong thing, flying blade is good. Oh, no, it's a blade you could throw. That's right, we saw that in the cutscene. Okay, great. But furthermore, we want to, um, I want to I wanna activate this, less, less damage. <laughs> Who is edge? And then, uh, so sure, we can do the blade throw. I can actually move up and do the blade throw. Oh, that, that'll hit him. That'll be perfect. But wait, is there something else we can do? Oh yeah, we forgot to scout, didn't we? Let's, let's scout. Does this guy have any weaknesses that we need to know about? Undashable, cannot be dashed, resistant to everything basically. So we're just gonna have to do it, giant wild claws and just have to deal with it. These guys don't have any, okay. So with that said, um, let's close that out. Let me switch over here. Uh, we can still give him the burn. Oh, no target, what? Oh yeah. All weapon base attack. This is just for me, right? So I don't quite have a. Do I have anything I can do at all? With my disruptor, I do not. What does this do? Exhaust. No target in range. Okay. Well. Darn. Uh, I'm just gonna maybe relax here. Then what does what does Mario have? Duels. Yeah. Fires two projectiles. Got it. What about this? Turbo charge. Here, let me, can I? Let's, let's turbocharge these allies then. All right, and then, um, let's switch to edge. Let's go. Wow, wow. No, 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 he's coming close, what the heck? All right, Mario though, on the other hand. He still doesn't have anything. Uh, what about Mario now? He can he can shoot him and him. Oh, dude, he's moving close. Uh, what about now? Now can you do something? No, it's still not within range. And then the ZR doesn't do anything either. So I think we're gonna have to just end the turn. I'm a little bit worried about how close this guy is though, but let's give the enemy their turn. I mean, you can try to break these blocks. This is our first boss battle. Okay, he's close, he's close, he's real close. He's scary close. Oh, dear. That was rough, that was rough. What is this? Look, those appear to be darkness portals. Destroy them quickly. More enemies are bound to pop out soon. Oh, great. All right, so with that said, can I reach this guy yet? I can, I can disrupt. Throws one disc, uh, ignores partial cover. Oh, that's cool. But what is, what is this other thing that I got? Weaken, weaken him, weaken him. I didn't bring a healer, that was my mistake. So he's hit, a critical hit. He's gonna move closer to me, which I hate. Uh, oh, I can't move, oh dear. Uh, okay, well. He's undashable too, by the way, so that's good to know. Where do I want to go here? Oh my gosh. I need to destroy that portal somehow. I don't know how. Can I target the portal from here? I can't target him. I can target him, which will maybe make him come this way. Take that! Not bad, not bad. Is he gonna move closer to me though? He is. I'll use Stormblade, just I don't know if Stormblade's gonna be effective, but if he gets closer to me, I wanna be able to slice him, even though he might kill Edge. Uh, he can't do anything, dude. Actually, can I, can I? I'm gonna try to move back. Can I still shoot him from here? I can maybe shoot him. 
Okay, well. Just in case anyone moves. This is scary. This is a boss fight. This is for real. I should have brought some healing capabilities. Oh, that only got that's only 60. You can't reach me with that. Come on, what are you thinking? Mario's gonna get you though. Gone. Alright. He's so close. Oh my go on. No, you're gonna kill him. Alright, that's fine. Undashable though. This portal. Oh great. Great. I couldn't get to it in time. There's only one enemy though. That's not so bad. Oh, there's one over here though. Um Okay, so we gotta shoot these portals, sadly. To prevent enemies from getting out here, right? Dude, I only got Can I dash this portal? No? Dang, I don't like the idea of enemies coming out here. Oh man, I, I can dash this guy though, right? One day. All right, I need a retreat or something. Is this portal within range? I did hit a critical hit, that's good, that's good to know. And then do I have anything in my bag to heal me? I do have a super mushroom. There you go. There you go, there you go. Didn't need to know that. Okay, anyway, uh, <laughs> no. Um. Yeah, so I could be here. I could shoot this twice. Oh, dang, the portal's still there. It's barely there. Great. Um, well, with that said, um, that's not much. He's immune to burn, but I'm still applying it. I don't care. Does it do any more damage? I can't even tell. Is he gonna, he's gonna get closer to me. Is he gonna be able to touch me next round? I don't even know. Well, okay, let's just give the enemy a turn then. How close, how close? Not close enough. Great. I wasn't strong enough to get that out, but whatever. Sure. All right, uh, so this guy's actually in range, which is pretty cool. <laughs> this flying blade is really strong. Oh, you know what? He's, <laughs> he's going around this way. That's funny. All right. Um, that's exactly what I wanted, honestly. Can I reach him from here? No, I cannot, so I need to be here probably. What does Illuma do again? All right. yeah. Here we go. Target him. Those are both critical hits. He's moving close to me. Uh, and then, well, I could actually, me myself, move over. Can I, can I reach him from here? No. <laughs> Not at all. Here it is then. He's almost he's almost defeated. This is great news. Oh man. Uh alright, enemy gets a turn. He, he's probably gonna get attacked next turn. This guy's still alive, forgot about him, honestly. Nice. Well, I'm just gonna target the big boy then because. Dang, that's such a big hit. All right, the portals, I don't care about. I'm gonna try to just get this guy beaten because he's so close to it. I'm gonna move over here. He's gonna get, actually, I think if I'm just out in the open, no, 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 hold on. Actually, Mario will shoot him first to draw him out. Yeah, Mario's gonna shoot him first, I think. Dang, he can't reach him from there, can he? Yeah, he can. All right. Nice. And then furthermore, he's gonna do this, the hero sight. He's gonna move because he's gonna get shot. And then Mario can deal hero sight damage. So, but I think this might just take him out anyway. This is it. Gotcha. 
Just do, I, do I have to beat the rest of the people? No, battle clear. Just had to beat the boss. Thank you, Edge. Purified darkness, dark mist energy crystal obtained. And battle cleared. And we are level four. Awesome. And everyone's level four, which is good. I need to start actually spending my upgrade points now. And so, uh, no, I'm not going to play again. <laughs> it's like, play again. I'm like, I, uh, I'm okay. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Excuse me, intimidating stranger. It's vitally important that the spark come with us to the lighthouse. Until we destroy the lighthouse tentacle, we can't create warp tunnels to other planets, and eventually to Cursa. I can unlock the lighthouse. Watch, I'll meet you there, says Twinkle. Oh, Augie. Bingo, bingo, bongo, baby. <laughs> you got the spark. Let's get it to the lighthouse and... And what? Yeah. God, you again, the spark hunter. Not a spark hunter. Name's Edge. Great. Rabbit Edge. <laughs> Rabbit Edge. Edge. Just Edge. Spaceship, huh? You got a spaceship, huh? Guess you can ride sidecar with me for a time. It's not like you can't use the help. Speaking of help, I believe it's time we start keeping three heroes on our front line. Who'll take the first shift? <laughs> Might as well just have all the heroes. <laughs> all right. Three heroes. Third team slot unlocked. You can now bring with you another hero. Open the team selection to select who you want to bring. In deep water, main quest complete. Purified darkness energy crystal. Number one. Collected. <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> and we level up again. Giant enemies, a new memory. And so, come rain or shine will be the next main quest. And there's some new side quests as well unlocked. So, uh, I guess next episode we will showcase that. That'll be exciting. We have a new member of our team. Thank you, of course. We got new sparks too. Thank you, of course, for liking this video. Be sure to subscribe if you want to keep up with this series because I'm going to be putting out episodes daily until it's done. We got so many things unlocked. Galactic Blade. So many things. We'll check it out uh, at the end of next episode. Goodbye and thank you for watching. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.